welcome to Wilderness Wanderers. We recently spent a long weekend in the Alabama hills on BLM land camping. We want to share with you in this video three things that we loved about camping on BLM land and three things that weren't quite so good. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We drop new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. Here we go. Into the sunshine, come and see what it feels like. The Alabama Hills are located at the gateway of the Eastern Sierras, right outside of Lone Pine, California. I spread my wings and let go, something stirring in my soul. Our first positive for staying in the Alabama Hills is the outstanding camp location. This footage begins at the back of our trailer. There are no words to describe how beautiful it is here. This is right outside our camp. Down there, Django Unchained. That's how close the um, scene from Django Unchained, one of the many movies that was filmed here. We are out here hiking just feet, a few feet from our camp and there's giant rocks everywhere, flat rocks everywhere. These little, little canyons that go in between the rocks are like little slot canyons that are really fun to hike through. It's amazing out here. And if you turn around, what do you have? You've got Whitney and the uh, Eastern Sierra. The second positive is the views. We simply can't say enough about how stunning it was to wake up to this every morning. Ready to live, ready to live, ready to live. Like a dove, I fly away. Now's the time today. Our third positive was the hiking. This place is great for families with young children or pets. No cactus, wide open spaces, and the rocks were so much fun to climb on. We are at Lone Ranger Canyon. Isn't it cool? It is cool. And we think this is the rocks that they use it in is. the Lone what Ranger TV show. Over 400 movies and TV shows have been filmed in the Alabama Hills, beginning in 1919 with Water, Water Everywhere, and then the more famous How the West Was Won and Gunga Din. The TV shows Bonanza and The Lone Ranger were both filmed in these canyons. More recently, it was used for blockbusters like Django Unchained with Jamie Foxx, The Lone Ranger with Johnny Depp, and Iron Man with Robert Downey Jr. We're off to the bowling pins. Also, we're going to research where Iron Man was filmed, one of my favorite movies. So we're going to go see if we can find out where that was. First negative. This is an off-road experience. Once you leave Movie Road, the dirt road can be dangerous if you're not certain where to camp. We almost drove down a road which would have severely damaged our trailer had we not got out to look. Negative two, there are no site boundaries. It's all a first come first serve basis and you cannot control who camps near you or how close they camp. We had a young couple asked to camp directly behind us and they were lovely and it was only for one night. Others may not be so lucky. You could have someone who runs their generator nonstop or parties all night. Song. We 
Third negative, there is absolutely no amenities here for RVers. No water, no dump, and no trash cans. It is definitely not for anyone used to RV parks and their services. Whilst we prepared and loved this scenario, it isn't for everyone. We hope you've enjoyed our video all about camping in the Alabama hills. If you're ready to boondock, we highly recommend going here. If you've enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. You can also follow us on social media. If you're not a subscriber yet, don't miss out. Hit that subscribe button. We drop new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. Our next video is a hike in the San Bernardino National Forest. From Cat and Cab, your wilderness wanderers, we'll see you on the trail.